Mohamed Taufik. And in the black corner, it's Kilpit Get Pry Son. And the referee in charge for this match is Prajak Ngam. Judge ringside, Phuket Pram, Payun, Siprat, Jumsuk, and Yong Yut Apaiso. Seven centimetre high advantage for Mohamed Taufik. Of course, the experience goes to the Thai fighter Kiopet. Yeah, Taufik, I mean, he's been in town for a while. Of course, not as long as some of the other people we've seen on the card here today, but he's doing quite a good job. Seen him have victories in Rajanandan and in Lumpini. Already testing the waters with that right high kick. Very tall for this weight. Oh, yes. Oh, jumping front kick there by Kiopet. Not only is he tall for his weight, but he knows how to use his size. Yeah. And of course, I think just 19 years of age, Kiopet 22. Wouldn't surprise me if we see this rivalry continue for years to come. Oh, yeah. Potentially heading straight to the top. Pick very good as we said using of using his size to his Ooh. advantage when he does get close he likes to clinch up likes to throw his opponents around to throw knee. yeah looking for the old elbow strike as well he at the moment think about re-strategizing every time he goes for a kick something comes right back at Adam oh attempted question mark kick which he uh, connected with in his last fight doesn't happen this time one shot there for Tafi Taufik now just losing his balance. But it was never a surprise. We always thought that Taufik was going to be the aggressor moving forward. Oh, of course. But now he's trying to wrestle Kilpit to the ground. Letting him know he's there. Yeah, he certainly is. I mean, the size helps. And a left hook there from Kilpit. And now more clinching from Taufik. The run so far from Taufik. Straight in Kilpit. Left kick, sorry, right kick to the body there by the very tall Moroccan. Then with those left kick, good team there by Taufik. Take down by Kiopet. Yeah, Taufik attempting to use that aggression, but you know, sometimes when you do get aggressive, you lose your head a little bit. I think that's what happened with Taufik just now. Oh, good knee to the midsection again by the Moroccan. Yeah. Using his height well, and there's a cut under the eye, a big cut, I believe. Whatever can do in on that. Of Kiopet to the left eye. And yeah, there's blood, you can see it on his ropes. Yeah, it's been a difficult round for Kiopet so far. Oh, big left hand! See that? Sometimes that can happen when fighters start to see their own blood. Another elbow through the guard, big right elbow of his own, right Kiopet. He decided to turn this into a brawl, and there you can see that cut. End of round number one here on Thai Fight. Coming into the second round is Kilkit. Kilpit, Kid Paison in the black corner, Mohamed Taufik from Morocco in the white. And what a good round for Mohamed Taufik, really using his size to his strengths. But it's not the first time we've seen it. I mean, we see it time and time again. You and Roger and me and Lumpini. Yeah. And things are really going well for him. But then towards the end of that round, I'm not saying that, and that's the cut, that's the elbow that she cut Kilpit, by the way. Straight elbow, straight to the chin, or to the cheek, excuse me. I think he might have actually been cut before that. I'm not actually sure where it did occur. But either when he saw his blood, then he started to attack Kilpet. Oh, that's nasty. I was getting to that. Ooh. But Kilpet, he took his time to get started for the last bout. So, the same thing might happen in this bout as well. Really like this matchup. Yeah, but so far, things are going so well for Mohamed Taufik. I think we're going to see a different fighter now in Kilpet. Doesn't look like he's wanting to back up going to take it to Mohamed Taufik, which of course can play into the hands of the Moroccan fighter. Good left and right hands there as the elbows fly once again by the Moroccan fighter. That's right, Kilpet now not taking a step back. I mean, he knew in that oh, first round. A, what's, what's the issue? There's a cut somewhere. There's a cut on Mohamed? Yes, that is right. It's raining blood all over his chest. Uh, I wonder how bad it really is. Can we get a camera on there? Yeah, we need to get a camera. 
Our Telfix says there's nothing wrong with him. The doctor agrees. Well, we can't see it, so we're going to assume it's fine. <laughs> <laughs> uh, doctor definitely saw it, though. Yo, Pep, bringing the heat night round number two. Much more aggression being shown here by the tie. Yeah, like we said, a very tricky oh, Pep. Right hand. Oh, this is absolutely amazing. Oh, another big right hand. Yo, hey, where did this come from? You can do it all. Are we going to stop the fight? There's oh, another no. cut. There is another cut, ladies and gentlemen. I'm not sure it's another cut or the, the original cut's been opened even more. Well, it's more visible now, that's for sure. Doctor having a look once again. What aggression, though, from Kyo Pet. Who would have expected that? Difficult to see when it's... Doctor says okay, therefore we say okay. The crowd are happy. And I'm happy as well. <laughs> Loving this match so far. Got to the body there. Elbow war here on tight fight. Left kick there. Better by Mohammed. Using that range that we saw in round number one. And Kilpet still moving forward, not taking a step back at all in this round. Unlike the first round, and it's working so well for him. Boxing Big body shot. Another body shot there for Kilpet. Shots to the head. Incredible. Taking it through behind the coffee. How is he able to stay on his feet? I had no idea Kilpet could fight like this. He seems like a man possessed right now. Right hand, another right hand there from Kilpet. What a war this is. Oh my word. Unbelievable war and a great oh. matchup. First round we saw Kiel Pet, he more cautious and he got cut to the second round he thought well let's go for it, he bit down on his gum shield. Kiel Pet did the right thing, he went back in the first round and he lost, he definitely lost on my official scorecard and now he's going forward and doing all the right things and I believe he's winning this round, there's no oh, doubt about it. I love that left hook to the body, oh another big right elbow to the head by Kiel Pet, deep there, once again to the body of Mohamed Taufik, going down to the body. Hurting, Taufik with body strikes. Taufik now in the corner. Trying to get out of that deadly situation. Good elbow there for Kilpin once again. Right in the corner where we are. What a fight here on Thai Fight, the third round. Up next. Take a look at that second round. I mean, oh. What a round it was. Kilpet on my own official scorecard, as I said, lost in the first. And now in the second, he knew he couldn't move back anymore and he decided to go forward and dish out a lot of punishments. I mean, it was twice in that round where the doctors actually had to check Mohamed Taufik to see if the cuts were okay for him to continue. Oh, I, I was pinning back over there. I was actually comparing him to Sanchai before the fight began, but in that round two, more of a Sayok. Yeah type of approach and I'll tell you what it worked for him. He's got a little bit of everybody from Thai <laughs> fighting him. In the first round he was more of a kitty sack. <laughs> the in the second round came out as kitty sack does. Well that leads me on to not forgetting the gold main event, the Thai Fight 71. What a dark leg. In the meantime, what a war it has been between two young guns here on Thai Fight. All right, here we go. Round three. You can't get one apiece. Yep, I'm calling it one apiece. Big high kick there from Mohamed Taufik, almost taking Kilpet off balance. Kilpet now, though, he needs to start moving forward if he wants to win. The same can be said from Mohamed Taufik. The body. Kilpet backing up. Not sure if that's smart or not. We want to see more of what we saw in round number two. Big kick to the body there from Kilpet. You don't want to exchange kicks with Kill Pet. He's got those fast kicks. They're just so accurate and so powerful. But in terms of leg length, Mohamed Taufi, so much taller. Jumping. And he connects with the head. <laughs> and that's where you said that that's where yeah. the inner Sanchai is yeah. from. Right hand 
connects there with Flora and Kilpet. Yeah, a lot more calm yeah. from Kilpet, but I a lot like, more accurate. I feel like both these fighters have now come out in the third, and they know that if they win this round, they win the fight. So it's one of those things where they just don't want to make a mistake. That's why we've got an edgy third round now. Yeah, we've got an extremely edgy first round. Big head kick there from Kilpet. Goldfix trying to go for that low kick. Doesn't he connect it very well though. Some people in the chat think that Kilpet is actually two up. Think for that. Any scope? Yeah, I'm not sure. I mean, I thought Marmitown Fix did enough in the first round to go ahead, but he's in the road. We're not judges, ladies and gentlemen. Oh, beautiful delayed right high kick there by Kilpit. There's very one thing for clever, sure. There's one clever. thing for sure. Taufik needs to start moving forward yes. now. He needs to start attacking now. He can't wait. Yeah, he's down in round number three here. Yeah, if he continues it this way, under the judges score in favor of him. Taufik now going to the clinch. All caught up in the ropes. Referee has no choice but to separate them. Said this has the potential to be a rivalry that can last many years. Stand by that as well, these two. Remember, 19 and 22 years of age. Yeah, I can see that being a thing as well. Fantastic young fighters, hot prospects. Another hand there from Kilpet. Kilpet now moving forward, the man from Drug. Oh, good left step indeed there. Right kick to the body by Kilpet. Swinging right hand, Kilpet grabs the hold. Ooh, it's close. It is very close. But I think Kilpet has done enough so far in this round. We'll have to see. Yeah, I feel like the most significant strikes have come from the Thai fighter. Another right kick by Kilpet. Yeah, we thought we'd see another aggressive yeah, Kilpet. Absolutely did. He's trying to play it safe, but I still believe it worked out for him. Yeah, whole fight is showing respect. Maybe far too much respect in round number three, but either way, tremendous second round. Round of the night so far. Uh, although that Tengnen first round was pretty incredible. <laughs> but yeah, great fight nonetheless by two fantastic fighters. We will go to the judges' scorecard for, I believe, the first time. Let's have a look at the highlights. Neopet reaching. Difficult against such a tall fighter. And props to Mohamed Taufik. He knows how to use that height, which a lot of fighters don't know how to do. That was smart. That was tricky by Kilpet. Yeah, Kilpet, extremely tricky. And I like how he can adapt his style to any opponent he yeah. takes on. All right, let's get the official decision and then Vero is next up. Here we go. ตัวจริงกันทั้งคู่สำหรับลุ้นไฮไฟคาดเชื่อสังวินเลือกตัวจริงนะฮะเลือดสาดกันเลยนะครับถึงเวลาประกาศผู้ชนะครับ The Defenders Kiopet Kiopet Price of Thailand. Oh, ต้องอย่างนี้ครับมวยมันมาจากไทยไฟนะฮะดูลีลานะครับแตกเป็นแตกกันไปเลยฮะเอาละครับนี่คือความมันของมวยข้าเชื่อนะครับอย่างไทยไฟนะครับยังมาสะใจต่อแน่นอนในตอนนี้พักสักครู่ครับ Rock with time.